Now the last of the three primary soft jerk bait techniques is the real fast retrieve, where you cast out, point your tip towards the water, and just reel like the Dickens. Um, again, it's a very effective technique for fast moving game fish. Now this is a technique that I primarily associate with saltwater fishing. Um, in my own practice, I'll use it on false albacore, school tuna, um, even in some cases Spanish mackerel when they show up in our warm waters on Cape Cod. But that's just in my neck of the woods. You can use this technique anywhere if there's fast moving game fish or a situation where there's fish in the area, they just don't respond to anything else and you need to wake them up a little bit. Other times, I like this technique just to create some commotion in an area that I'm fishing and I'll go back to one of my other two techniques, the slow and low or the traditional walk the dog. So what we're gonna do is always cast out, gauge the line, get connected with the lure before we start, then just reel. Simple as that, keep your tip towards the water, maybe a twitch every now and again, and that bait is gonna come humming in. The bait will just quiver as you're reeling. Then cast out, collect your line. Now another little tip here is to actually put your tip in the water to keep the bait from skipping completely on the surface. Now you wanna be careful not to reel your bait up into the guide. It'll happen from time to time, it happens to me, but just be aware of that. Cast out, get control, collect your line, tip down, maybe in the water, and just reel. One more time, simply cast out. Tip towards the water, or in the water, it's reeling. It's a great way to fish. You can see all your hits. And there you go. Now, if you want surface commotion, do the same thing. Cast out, get control of your lure, keep your tip up, and your bait will literally be skimming across the surface. Now, again, the technique that I associate with fast moving game fish, but it's also a great technique in an area where you know there's fish, you just want to create a little commotion just by skipping it across the surface. You almost can't reel it too fast. And it's pretty amazing stuff when a fish comes up and strikes the lure. It's moving so fast, the fish will be moving even faster. Ripping it on the surface. Tip in or out of the water. And there you go. Now that we have the three basic fundamental techniques for fishing with soft jerk baits, the walk the dog, the slower variation, and the fast moving through the water, you have a great starting point for fishing for any game fish anywhere in the world, quite literally. Now one other thing to keep in mind is, don't be afraid to change around, maybe mix the few uh, techniques together. What I probably do more times than not, quite frankly. Um, what I'll do anytime I'm new to an area and I haven't figured out what the fish are looking for, I'll try maybe one cast of each technique and then a variation. Just keep playing around until you know I figured out what the fish are looking for, basically you know getting dialed in. So maybe I'll cast out, start with a real fast retrieve and work into a walk the dog medium reel retrieve, rod tip towards the water, and then zip it back in. Might start out slow and low, let the bait sink. Okay, control the line, let the bait sink. Twitch, twitch, and then raise it up to the surface, get it to jump, then go into a traditional walk the dog technique. Now there's no set rule of thumb in terms of how to fish these soft baits. With these, but with these three basic techniques, playing around with them, you can find out what the fish are looking for and you'll be armed with the techniques necessary to catch any game fish anywhere.